So what we did in uh, our last study was we uh, took a group of 30 patients with severe periodontal disease and we provided them with treatment, which consists of skin and root training together with a full mouth and infection. And after having received this training, the patients were divided into two groups, one receiving a placebo and the other group were receiving a probiotic tablet. And the patients were asked to use either the placebo or the probiotic for three months. After three months, we had uh, recalled all our patients and we made some measurements. And what you can see uh, in, with this approach was that when we provided the patients with probiotic, they had on average about 0.6 millimeters more probing pocket depth production when they used the probiotic and when compared to the placebo. There was also significantly more gain in, in clinical attachment. And this was about 0.2 millimeters on, on average and went up to 0.8 millimeters in, in, in deep pockets. Another interesting um, result from the study was that we had about 20% less patients that were in need for additional surgery after having used the probiotic. And there was about 36% 36, 36 of, of the patients that uh, at the end of the study had less pockets deeper than 5 millimeters after having used the, the probiotic. And at the end, obviously, and, and this is confirmed by, by other studies also, um, the patients who are using the probiotics had about 50% less gingivitis and about 50% less plaque than the patients who were using the placebo. So at the end, these uh, results were for us very interesting and, and uh, maybe a little bit surprising, I don't know. Um, but um, they provide us at least with some uh, evidence that this probiotic was actively interfering with the microbiota with the clinical parameters during healing after skin and root failure. These results have for sure changed my ideas about probiotic, that's clear. If they have changed my therapy, I think it's a little bit too early at the moment. Although the, the data are very tempting and, and, and very nice, as a scientist, I like to see my own data even confirmed by other ones. And um, before really making it, because this, this would mean a radical change, and a radical change in our thinking. So before doing that, I want to see my own data confirmed by others. However, on the other side, um, yes, it changes my, my approach to those patients where um, I'm with my back to the wall and I'm not sure what to do anymore and where I want to use everything what I have in my power to help them. In that way, yes, these patients are getting probiotic at the moment.